It's hard living. Life is hard. When you are 49 years old, been working on a job for 17 years, and they come in and tell you you're finished and give you one week severance pay, and you got to start all over again. It's hard when you are married and raising children, and your children are crawling, and your husband dies unexpectedly. It's hard handling just the tragedies of life. It's hard when you're working on something and, and you put everything you have in it, and it doesn't work out, you lose your money and other people's money. It's hard. It was rough when I lost my job and I could not find a job. It was humiliating and embarrassing borrowing money and then I couldn't pay the money back when I told them I would. That's rough. How people look at you, how they respond to you. It's very hard. It's humiliating. Here's what I discovered that happens to you in life, that you will go through things and while you're going through them, you can't understand why it's happening to you. You do what it is you're supposed to. You're supposed to build something. You're supposed to create something. I don't know how to do it. Learn. Do whatever is required. Just go out there. It's possible you can get what you want. It's necessary. If you want it, you got to go into action. You got to be willing to experiment. You got to be willing to fail and to succeed. You got to be willing to form and to develop new relationships. It's you, it's on you, you gotta make that happen. Nobody's gonna bring it to you on a silver platter and say, here's your dream manifested. You go through the challenges of life and you look at it and embrace whatever comes to you. Don't run from it, step toward it. Don't try and duck it like most people do. See, most people want it easy. See, easy come, easy what? Easy go. See, but when you go at what you're going to deal with and you deal with the difficulties of it, when you handle those hard things close at hand, making those hard decisions right now that you don't want to make, the people who go after this stuff, what makes it worth it? It's got to be your passion. You got to love it, ladies and gentlemen. You gotta love it, it's gotta be what you are supposed to do. Learning those things that you don't like to do, but you know that in order for you to get where you wanna go, this is one of the hoops that you have to flip through. And I'm saying to you, whatever you gotta do, do it, because if you don't, Life is going to whoop you until you surrender. You must have faith. You've got to believe in yourself. You've got to believe in your abilities. You've got to believe in your service, your company, your ideas, unquestionably. You've got to have faith, and that faith gives you patience. That is not going to happen as quickly as you want it to happen. A lot of things are going to happen that will catch you off guard. And so therefore, you've got to deal with and handle it as it comes. And not only that, but that faith and patience drives you into action. You've got to keep moving and keep plugging away. The harder the battle, the sweeter the victory. See, when, you, when it's hard and there's a struggle, see, what you become in the process is more important than the dream. That's far more important. The kind of person you become, the character that you build, the courage that you develop, the faith that you're manifesting. People know that you know what life is, that you have embraced life. You knew it was hard, but you did it hard. It's hard, yes, it's hard. It's difficult, yes, right, and it's worth it.
You've got to believe in yourself. You've got to believe in your abilities. You've got to believe in your service, your company, your ideas. Unquestionably, you must have faith. It's hard. Yes, it's hard. It's difficult. Yes, right. And it's worth it.